that look better. The camera looked too red a while ago. Look like a red fox. Why people can't read my body language? Root, roots, roots, um, something, something. So I look like I'm mad at the world. Oh, you just pick up that semi angry. Or uh, disappointed or uh, troubled. Oh, you pick up that. I'm actually. Um, I'm actually. have some contention with the. Um, yeah. I have to make sure so I choose my words and carefully. I have to make sure I choose my words, my words and carefully because I don't want to um, fall into a trap that I believe um, Christopher Townsend is setting for me. So I'm trying to choose my words correctly because I'm not going to um, I'm not going to fall into that 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 um, rat trap where the match I set for me. Yeah. So I'm, I'm gonna try and be as contained as I should. Yeah, choose my words and properly. So whatever I'm gonna talk about here is something that has been reported on. Um, so I'm staying objective, very objective um, on this matter. Yeah. So what I'm reading at this point. What I'm about to read at this point is from the Jamaica um, Gleaner, right? These are not my personal words, this is from the Jamaica Gleaner. Munga trial postponed till 2025. Murder trial of dance and entertainer Munga, Munga Honorable postponed until 2025. The murder trial involving dance artist Munga Honorable was today postponed to February 17, 2025 in the Home Circuit Court. The entertainer whose real name is Damian Roden and his co-defendant, Sheridan Gordon, are charged, are charged in the connection with the 2017 murder of Cleveland, Cleveland Smith, that is actually my nephew. The trial was scheduled to begin today, that was yesterday. However, the matter failed to proceed due to personal challenges personal challenges being experienced by Munga's lawyer Christopher Townsend right so um, that is very a, a back story on this according to the, um, the, the Jamaica Gleaner again these are not my words um, I will not give what I, I will not say what I know of. I will go with what the Gleaner said, whether it is, um, whether there are, there are any accuracy with your statement, but I'm going to go with what the Gleaner said. The Gleaner states, according to police report, on the day in question, Smith, who is the nephew of dancehall artist Mr. Vegas, was accosted by a group of men one reportedly armed with a gun at a dance in Akiwak, St. Andrew. An altercation ensued resulting in Smith being shot and later pronounced dead at the Kingston Public Hospital. Prior to his death, Smith had injured Munga Honorable in a machete attack. Right? So, that is from the Jamaica Star. Right? Jamaica Gleaner, excuse me. This case has been going on for like, um, has been um, an ongoing trial. It's not even a trial, because the trial has started, so what we call it? Um, the matter has been in front of the court um, since what, 2017, I'm saying? Yeah. Are there about? 
And I'm trying to get clarification, or I would like to get clarification on um, the trial being postponed for almost two years at this point because of personal um, personal issues with Mr. Townsend. I don't no, no, no really 100% sure how the justice system works. I want to know that justice delayed means um, justice denied. Right? Um, due to personal challenges being experienced by um, the accused, the lawyer. I'm trying to figure out um, if, if this two years postponement is because the lawyer needs two years to take a leave of absent. Is this lawyer um, is this lawyer having personal issues means that um, all these other cases will be postponed until 2025 and thereafter? Or they just or this is the only available date that they have um, you know, based on the backlog or whatever in the system. I don't know because I think it's a little bit vague. You know, a lawyer, a personal experience, and you just postpone a case until 2025. So I, 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 would, like to, I would like to get some answers from the justice system. Um, if, this is a, if, this, if this is a case where Mr. Townsend is, is, is having issues across the board, all around, or is he having issues with Cleveland Smith, um, Smith's case, or, 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 or the artist's case, right? According to the artist in another article that I read, he is disappointed that the case was postponed until so you know such a later date. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to take after that. I'm just saying what what is out there. I'm not trying. I'm, I'm not trying to assume. I'm not making any, any assumption here. <clears throat> But, but I think, as a citizen and as a family member, I would like to hear more from the, the justice system. Is this a situation where um, Mr. Townsend is having personal issues where all of his cases are going to be postponed until a later date? Cases like, I think he's representing um, Noel Maitland. Uh, what was the guy name what, 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 that is accused of killing Donnelly? He's representing that person. I think it's Noel Maitland is his name. He's also representing Jennifer Masado um, on my last check. I don't know if he's still the lawyer in that case, um, with the Mavado case. So I'm, I'm, I will be watching uh, um, keenly, you know, to get some clarity on what happened, what is happening with Cleveland Smith's case. Yeah? And I believe that every man is innocent until proven guilty. You understand? So the DJ must get him there in court so he can answer to the charges. You understand what I say? So, um... I just want to know, I just want to know if all the cases that Mr. Townsend is, you know, you know representing um, these persons, yeah, or these, 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 these accused, I want to know if all these cases are going to be postponed until such a, a, a later date, you know, you know, you know, because I don't know what it means, like Mr. 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 Townsend is having, um, you know, legal I'm not legal, personal, excuse me, issues. I don't know if it's with this case or if it's just him as a person having some challenges. You understand what I'm saying? I think, I think it's a little bit vague from the justice system. I think it's vague that this report came out and we, we, we are not clear. Uh, we are not, I am not 100% certain. Yeah? Not even 20% certain. What, it, what is it? Is it? Is it issues with this case, you know, in terms of, oh, the lawyer needs more time to gather information, the lawyer needs more time to, to go through the case, whatever it is, you know, you know, we don't know, you see, and I have to be very, I, I, I purposely have not said anything on this, on this matter because Mr. Townsend um, warned Mr. Vegas um, um, a few years ago, and it's the first I will talking about this case, and I'm, that's why I'm keeping it you know, hundred with, you know, you know, with what is out there, what is being reported. So, in, um, when was this? This was 
2021, Mr. Townsend sent a warning to me and accused me falsely of speaking about the case. He said here in an article, um, asked whether he was concerned that certain bloggers and commentators like Mr. Vegas, a relative of the victim, could, could, you know, could make pronouncements of the case in public in the public arena right um townsend replied according to the article we have some issues with how he has made comments in the past we understand that he is angry well mr townsend there was no um study or any evaluation for you to say i am angry i don't know where you get that from to say i i i, I was angry but in but may realize no say you're more than just a lawyer you're actually somebody who can determine emotions um and by somebody not speaking or showing any signs of it um so according to the article mr townsend said he understands that i was angry but that doesn't give anyone the right to make pronouncements when they don't know the facts this is the first time i am speaking on this matter and i am speaking on this matter based on what came out yesterday the postponement until 2025 you know almost two years from this date or uh, from the date you know of the of the of what was supposed to be the trial yeah so i i i, I can i am concerned you know i'm concerned because i am not sure if of, uh, if this is some form of tactics yeah I'm not sure if this is some form of tactics that lawyers use to their advantage in terms of wearing out the witnesses. Yeah? And, um, you know, whatever. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not sure, you know, if this is some form of craft yeah, to, to wear out the witnesses so they, they, um, they may, you know, whatever. You know, forget what them did for say or whatever. This is my and questions. I'm not sure. I don't know. Is is that is that the case? I don't know. I just asking questions. You see? At the same time, you know, every man for deserve every man deserves a fair trial. And um every victim deserves justice. You understand? Yeah. You see what I say? So me no know. Me no know. Me no know. I don't know, and anybody can make the case and you can look up the case and you can make your own commentary as, comment, comment, commentaries on it and whatever. Me just keep it at 100. Me just want to know if this is a tactic. I, I just want to know. Yeah, these are the questions I have for the justice system. Yeah, in case you think that Cleveland Smith was just like a dog, yeah, or like he was nobody, or he, has no, or he had no one, or he had no family members, I just want you to know, say, me, I want them family members. You see? Yeah, and we are watching the case keenly. Yeah. We're watching the case keenly, justice system. Yeah? We're watching the case keenly, and we are being tight-lipped about the case. We're not going to say anything to compromise the case. We're going to keep it 100. <laughs> you see what I say? And make, you know, justice, you know, takes its course. You see? Or the, or the whatever. But we are watching it still, and we will wait until 2025 to see if it's gonna be you know further postponed until maybe 2027 until 2029 until 2030 and we'll be here yeah yeah man we'll be here we'll be here so we wait until 2025 yeah and we'll look a little bit of clarity because we'll be watching if mr townsend will be representing noel maitland before 2025 so if we see him representing anyone else, we will understand that it is not an issue with his personal issues. It's, a, it's an issue with Cleveland Smith's case. You understand? Yeah, we will understand that. So I, 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 I'm, I'm looking for that too, justice system. Yeah. In Jamaica justice system, I am watching keenly to see if Mr. Townsend will be representing those people, those, those other persons that he's, he's representing in the courts. So Mr. Townsend, I know you're looking for me to say things on the matter because you tried to insinuate or you insinuated prior that I was speaking on the matter. This is my first time speaking on the matter and this is directed to you, Mr. Townsend. Yeah? Because I, I, I am, you know, 
the, 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 the article was not clear, you know? Yeah, it was not clear on what the personal challenges, you know, you know, are that you're having. You understand? So I will be looking if you'll be representing Jennifer Masada, if you are still the attorney, before 2025. Then I will understand that it is not a personal issue where you cannot practice. Yeah, it's not a personal issue where you take a leave of absence. Yeah, that is not that that is not the case. So I will then understand, and then I will be contacting the justice system to get clarity on why the case was postponed for almost two years because what personal challenges you are having. Because as a family member, I think we are entitled to know what type of personal challenges you are having if it has anything to do with the case. You understand? I think we need a statement, and if we don't get a statement. We'll be watching keenly, Mr. Townsend. Yeah? So, just to remind you, you already know that I am his ne I am his uncle. Yeah? I am Cleveland's, the deceased uncle. Yeah? I am the deceased uncle, and he's not just a drunk girl that them licked down on the roadside. Yeah? Just want you to know that. Alright? Big up on yourself. Give thanks.